Huh? Ah! Hello, my going viewers. Welcome back. And today, I just want to say, since it's, you know, Halloween and stuff like that, I thought it would be appropriate to share a scary story of mine. You know, a supernatural experience that I had when I was little. So, I think it's the perfect time of year. And hopefully, I... And you believe it or not, if you don't want to be a skeptic or not, it's a real experience by me. So, without further ado, <laughs> let's begin. <laughs> okay, so the story starts off at my old house. It was a good home where I lived. It was on a good hill. It was so, I can't ex describe it very well, but what I do remember is that I love the house dearly. And, but the one thing about this house that terrified me was a hallway we had. Now this hallway, it was terrifying to me when I was little. No matter what I did, no matter what I do, I would always be terrified because my room was at the very end. My parents' room was right next to mine and another room. But the one thing that might have terrified me the most is that I kept having this dream of this girl. She had light gray clothes, she had a dark gray skirt, and her hair was dark gray. Now, this wouldn't be so scary if I didn't wake up to a dream like this. She was over my body in my bed when I was on my bed. Her skin was decaying. Her eyes were go were like ghost eyes, and she was just staring at me, not moving, not blinking, nothing. And before y'all start saying, maybe you saw this in a movie. This was during I was in elementary school, halfway through. So I can't really say it was a it was horror movies that caused this. It just happened. And what made it worse is that after a few weeks, I had a little experience. So I'm about to go down the hallway to go to bed. And then I turn around, right as I look up, I see her looking dead dead at me. Exactly how my dream dreams have been. She looks at me, no move, not moving at all, and I am just in shock. So what do I do? I just stand there. And after I blink a couple of times, she disappears and I've never seen her since now granted that's not the scariest story I have but it's still my story nonetheless and I hope you guys enjoyed it but before this video ends I just want to say one thing this Halloween it's going to be so cold almost close to freezing so please please stay warm but besides that I'm glad you guys enjoyed this video and if you guys have any horror stories of your own please leave them in the comments section I want to hear your stories happy Halloween everyone